tonight, I'm going to go over how and why I set up a water harvesting system on my AC condensation drip outlet here. So normally, people just leave these to drip at the base of their foundation. It looks like only a tiny bit of water, so why would you bother doing anything about it? Uh, but when you actually go to harvest this water, you'll find there's quite a bit of water accumulates over time, especially in the later summer where it's moist and the AC is running all the time. So the first idea we start with is just putting a bucket underneath, as shown here. And the problem with that is the drips tend to miss the bucket and run down the side of the house, which isn't very useful. So instead, we need to implement something that will uh, force the water into the bucket. So here I'm using a piece of uh, a plastic, like a sheet of plastic that I punch some holes in and put a twist tie around and I can attach that like a bib underneath the condensation drip outlet and it will then reroute all the water into the bucket and away from the house. Then I'm going to add on top of the bucket uh, some uh, bug netting and a lid. Uh, so the bug netting to prevent mosquitoes from breeding in the water and then the lid to prevent evaporation uh, so that I don't lose all the water that I'm trying to harvest because it is very dry here in Arizona. So typically in July, August, and September, I can harvest about two gallons per day using this method. And the water is pure distilled water, so it's great for the plants. So my bucket holds about 10 gallons, and that's the most that I could fit in the space. And that means about every five days I need to come out, take the water, and use it to water my plants with. Uh, otherwise, it will start to overflow. This is a significant amount of water for a desert garden. Typically, I use it in a slow drip bucket that I built myself. It's a five gallon bucket with a slow dripping head on it. So it will drip uh, the water out in the course of about an hour. It's a great source of supplemental water and your plants will love it and so will your foundation.